at 10 o'clock, after more than two years of work and hours of long public meetings, the Greenville City Council made a decision tonight on the new development code. Fox Carolina's Kennedy Harris has been following those developments, sitting in on those meetings. Mm -hmm. So Kennedy, what was the outcome of that vote tonight? Well, tonight was another long meeting. It started at 5.30, didn't end until around 8.30, but it ended with a vote we've been waiting for and an outcome many people were happy with. City Council unanimously approved the new development code, which will guide the way Greenville grows. City staff says the code protects neighborhoods from ill-suited development in a way that's never been done before. The council voted pretty fast. It was the public comment that took up most of the meeting time. More than 40 people spoke spoke and an overwhelming majority spoke in support. Only about nine people asked the council not to approve it, most of them asking for more time to review it. Since this has been such a lengthy process for staff, there was applause and even tears at the end. Leaders are confident the new code will allow the 2040 plan to become a reality. That's the problem. We never took time to wipe it out and do what was right. And so I'm so glad to see us moving progressively into a way that we should do, which will help to make neighborhoods, every neighborhood, feel better. And there will be a second and final vote later on and also a six month review of the code where staff can change any issues or concerns that may come up. The city also hired a new staff member who's tasked to help leaders with a new diversity initiative. We'll have more on that tonight at 11.